Polly, welcome. Thank you so much. Okay, now we're going to do a yoka with you. Are you ready? Yeah, absolutely. Totally ready? Yes, I am. Young blood and young blood is always ready. Yes, for sure. Okay, all right. Now we're going to do something about quick. The word quick, okay? All right, are you ready? Let's go. The quickest meal you've ever had. A pastry? The quickest shower you've ever had. Uh, one and a half minutes. One and a half minutes. Now all the girls are imagining how he takes that one and a half minute shower. I know, I know. Okay, awesome. The quickest date you have ever had. Um, actually, I went on a blind date, which ended in about five minutes. <gasps> what? I saw the girl and I ran away. <laughs> that is so mean. What, was she re just really unattractive? She was ugly. I'm sorry, but she was ugly. Okay, that's harsh but true and that's what the youth is all about, honesty. Okay, so if I was the blind date, would you stay? Yes, for sure. Woo, saved. The quickest fight you've ever had. I don't fight, sorry. He's like Michael Jackson, well, how Michael Jackson was. A lover, not a hater, love that. The quickest half century you've ever made. Um, 30 balls. Which Bollywood actress would you love to see playing cricket? <laughs> Zanelia D'Souza. Oh, and why is that? I guess she's cute. I guess. Yeah, what do you like about her? She's cute, that's it. Okay. So he likes cute girls. Okay, now one quick question. Well, I mean, I've been asking you all the quick questions. Any locker room secrets that you guys talk about that we don't know because we don't get to come inside the locker room, damn it? That should be my job. That should be my real job, inside the locker rooms. But um, I don't get to come there. So is there anything that you guys talk to each other about before the game? Uh, nothing cheesy before the game, but after the game we have probably have a drink or, and stuff, you know. We talk the most weird things ever, which I, I actually can't say on TV, so yeah. Okay, fine. You know, nobody tells me secrets. I'm feeling so bad, but it's... I think Adelaide, they are making a standoff on, you know, uh, the amount of runs he's scoring. Uh, I think in most of the Australian grounds, you know, by the time he ends his career, you know, uh, quite a few Australian grounds will have his stand, you know. Uh, uh, but yes, he's batting really well. Uh, the important thing is, you know, he, he when he's taking a risk of playing a big shot, you know, he calculates it well. You know, it's easy to play the big shot. You know, everybody can play the big shot. But it's how you calculate, you know, what your strengths are. And according to that, when you take the risk, there's more chances of being successful. And also, he's somebody who looks to sc uh, score in front of the wicket. You know, of course, he's a good cutter and puller of the ball also. But at the same time, he looks to hit in front of the wicket that always gives you more chances of being successful and he, he has, he's, he's somebody who reads the game also well right from the very start you know whenever uh, we had any kind of interaction you know, he always he's always looking to improve himself you know as a cricketer and i feel that is something you know uh, that helps you improve and you know if you have that kind of a curiosity you know it helps you become a better cricketer you know order I feel that's what is really needed. Youngsters coming up, you know, grabbing that position, you know, it makes job easy for everyone. Else. Viewers, thanks to Virat Kohli's powerful 19 at out and Suresh Raina's 41. In reply, the Australians were bowled out for just 151 in 19.3 overs. Captain Alan Finch was Australia's highest scorer with 44. Minus report.